ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to New Gameplay Today Live. I am your host, Alex Stadnick. Join with me today, wonderful, wonderful video game people. You know them well. Kim Wallace. Hello, Kim. How are you? I'm doing good. How are you? I am fantastic. And the man with the beard, Jeff Cork himself. Hello, sir. Hey. Hello. How are you? Good. Good, good, good. I am so happy that you are joining us um, today. If you joined us yesterday, you'll know that we did uh, a pretty, uh, we, we did a deep dive, but also just scratched the surface of all the demos that Xbox and the indie developers have just put out. And uh, we wanted to, we knew that there was some more that we wanted to showcase and um, everyone seemed to have a good time yesterday. So we're like, you know, why not do it a second time? The sequel always yeah. does better than the, the first one, right? Right? Sure. Oh, yeah. We'll go with that. Yeah. Yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so today we're gonna look at a few more demos. Uh, check out. Uh, we're gonna start with Scourgebringer, 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 um, and then we'll just kind of go from there. Uh, these demos uh, went live yesterday or earlier Monday night, and uh, they're only available till July twenty seventh. So, um, a lot of these are exclusive to Xbox for the demo section of it. Um, but a lot of these have Steam pages that you'll probably be able to play elsewhere. But if you have an Xbox, now is the perfect time to jump on something like this. So, um, welcome to the stream. We'll get it, we'll get it uh, pop in here with Scourgebringer. This is one that Matt Miller was very high on yesterday and we didn't get a chance to, to dive into. So, so here we uh, go. On purpose just to antagonize him, be yeah. honest. <laughs> yeah, a little a bit. A little bit. Yeah. Perfect. Matt Miller is such an aggressive force and he's always been, <laughs> you know, <laughs> unkind to me so i yeah. i wanted to find a way to get back at him yep that's the way to do it he's one of the nicest people on the face of this earth he so. gets a knot yeah. very cool yeah <laughs> <laughs> oh, so chat hope you're doing well uh i'm curious uh for those who joined us yesterday who got a chance to actually go and play some of these things and if uh and if they like had any highlights or whatnot let us know but uh here we are playing scourgebringer so this is from um, I have it up. Uh, Flying Oaks game, Flying Oak Games. Their studio out of Metz, France, which I uh, don't know my French uh, geography, so I'm not sure where that is. But um, one of the cardinal directions of France. Ah, I see. Yeah. <laughs> um, and I think some people in the in uh, someone asked earlier in the chat if uh, what the thumbnail was from. It's from this game. So we're kicking off with Ooh. that, and then Kim and Jeff have some some games they cannot wait to show you. <laughs> So. Well, this was one of the ones that I played ahead of time just to, to check it out and see if it would make the cut. For sure. So, and in you got a it got a, a a Jeff blessing, as Except much as Alex will like this. Yeah, because <laughs> you're a big Celeste guy, right? Yes. So I love Celeste. I think that's when we look at back at this generation. I think it's it's one of the highlights for sure. And I'm already getting major vibes from that. So you were on point. Mm -hmm. um, and then when I did a little bit more looking. Um, they also, I also saw some Dead Cell comparisons, mm -hmm. and that is a, a recent love this year. Um, Dead Cells really is really, really great. Um, mm -hmm. So I was like, that's that sounds like a match made in heaven for me. Yeah. Um, Streaming-wise, we'll see how I do, because those games are very much, you know, I need that time to learn them. But, you know, no time like the present, right? Absolutely. I'm impressed that you're able to read all those tooltips while talking simultaneously, so... Yeah. <laughs> Making good use of all the knowledge. Reading, pretending to read, hoping I get uh -huh. it right. These are all the same things, yeah. really. It is a skill to learn how long you should wait for the text to appear on screen before you skip past it mm -hmm. when you're doing like any kind of like demo or playthrough or whatever yeah. for other people. A hundred percent. Because I'm a pretty fast reader, but I always try to give people like benefit of the doubt just in case. Yeah. But like at home I'm just like Bleh. <laughs> Yeah. I don't want to hear you talk anymore, missile. Is, it, <laughs> is that who's talking? A missile? Yeah, Blast, strange. Blast 32. Yeah, that's, that's <laughs> He has a right. name. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, come on now. It looks like a turbine, too, so I don't know what's quite <laughs> going on Actually, here. I hope you figure that out by yeah. the end of the story. What <laughs> are you, Blast 32? <laughs> that's I want to know whole... everything about you. Yeah, that's the whole purpose of this game. Yeah. yeah. Main, main character's got a lot of hair. Yeah. That's but... what I was going to say. Yeah. That's pretty good, right? Yeah. Of hair. Yeah, yeah, we like we like hair, I guess. I kind of remember this is a, a dated reference, but Phil Spector's uh, courtroom appearance. Remember he had that big afro? <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> kind of rem reminds me of that. Yeah, hmm. you were you were right on so many levels there. That is that is a yeah. deep cut. <laughs> Yikes. Yeah. 
So I when I was playing the demo, I don't know if those bells are just there for show. And maybe maybe I should read the tooltips instead of skipping past them. <laughs> yeah. But it seems like I wonder if something happens if you do ring the bells and also kill the enemies without touching the ground because it seems like that is doable like you go yeah. into a room it is absolutely just the way that uh, the like the enemies are positioned and everything you can you can stay in the air the entire time for sure yeah i uh that would be dope i cannot promise that on this stream we'll give it a shot though mm -hmm. <laughs> i'll do my best uh let's see uh, so Fantasy Thinker fan says, "What other games are you guys thinking uh, or planning on playing?" Um, Kim, do you you have a couple of games that you picked out, right? Yeah, I do. Um, if I can remember the games. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm curious. Is it was what Hell Hellheim Hustle? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, a game where you play as a Viking and um, kind of like Swery's The Missing, you like your body parts and use them to solve puzzles um it's kind of like a narrative puzzle game looked pretty interesting had a good sense of humor i'm excited for us to see that one um and then we also had um i had a little jrpg i was thinking we'd check out that's kind of more like old school um you know those 16-bit days uh called imperial um Oh god, what is the name? Amphirium Tail, right? Yeah. 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 So that thing looked pretty cool, just to kind of get you a little, like, flashback into everything. Mm -hmm. And then, um, there's this one called Dandy Ace, which is kind of like you pick up, um, you go through Dungeon car Crawler, but you also pick up, like, different cards, and so you make a deck, and your deck is your attacks as you go through, which seemed pretty interesting. Another one that had really good visuals and, um, good sense of humor, so, yeah, we got, we got a lot going Yeah, on we got a lot of good today. stuff there. Yeah. Oh, and Darkest Bill Castle, which, for those who like point-and-click adventures, like, uh, Secret of Monkey Island, um, we will definitely, uh, enjoy that. Cool. You're a you're a Secret of Monkey Island fan, aren't you, Cork? Yeah, I love Secret of Monkey Island. Cool. A fantastic game. Yeah, I'm about to die here. I think. We'll see though. Yeah, you weren't even talking that much. Yeah. <laughs> so yikes! There it is. Yeah. I'm see. a I'm an expert at these kinds of games when I'm watching because yeah. <laughs> every mistake you make is just so obviously avoidable. Yeah. Like, what are you doing, man? Okay. So this is this is a roguelite. Um. You know, the the world starts over after you after you die, which I wasn't planning on showing you, but you know, here we are. Um, I bet they they push you to dying so they sure. can show this off. In yeah, the demo. yeah. I was just I was doing it for you guys. That's right. Yeah. Thank there. you very much. <laughs> That's what I'm here for. Yep. Are we gonna see a game over screen in all these demos just to confirm that they do exist, Alex? Is that <laughs> is that your personal promise that is, to us, the viewer? I wasn't gonna spoil it, but I uh, okay. I, I think we can we can make something like that work. Thank you, I appreciate that. You gotta test out how good the game over screens are. Absolutely. Is it, you're dead, you have died, game over, yeah. the classic. All right, here we go. We got all that? I think so. I think we're okay. I think we're we're ready to go now. Alright. I like the RPG ones where like and none of them were ever heard from ever again. <laughs> oh. Like so somber and dark yeah. and Sad music, like yeah. think about what you've done. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> At least I can say something like uh, another group found the skeleton and they took the sword from you, your body. Yeah. Oh well. Or How are you I feeling about this? Said you died. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Everybody dies. That's that's an unfortunate fact of life. Exactly. Um. So far, so okay. good. I, it, the, yeah. the action yeah. feels really tight, and I'm liking it. Yeah? Yeah. You're, you're touching the ground a, a little too much a little for my taste. I want to see this next room. Challenge yourself, Alex. Okay. The floor is lava. Ooh, okay. Like oh, the, man. The hit Fork, you are a game hard show. Yeah. I, I just know he's capable of success. He has high success. Yeah. Yeah. Well. Well. <laughs> <laughs> well close enough. Yeah. It's a, a slow acting lava, we'll yeah. say. Cork will yeah. help him unlock his true potential. It's exactly. Fun. Yeah. Yeah. He believes in you. Yep. I'm like the I, fat I coach who's like mediocrity. yelling at people. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah. Well, I got through it. I don't know uh yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't I may have got singed a little bit, but you know, here yeah. we are. 
There's some measure of success, Alex. Yeah. You did it. <laughs> oh, the positivity is already absolutely. I, yeah. I miss those bells. Where'd those bells go? Yeah. Hey, wait a minute. Maybe it was only a starting thing. Yeah. I do wish they would give me a little bit more health, but maybe yeah. that's just because I'm bad and starting out here. What? What do you think of like the shooting? Um, the shooting is a nice little differentiation that um, mm -hmm. that I think could, in the right hands, switch up combat in a in a fun way. Um, I'm trying to see. Attempt to okay. I just want to see like if I'm missing like how to upgrade. Um, oh okay. Let's see if if they're letting me yet. I may mm -hmm. be too early on in the the experience. So let's see. I already tell that one's going to be your best friend. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. Get one more permanent health. We like that. Okay. Well, ch okay, good. It shows you what you can get next. Yeah. Kim, are you a fan of, of these type of, type of games? Yeah, I play some of them. I like anything with a good progression upgrade system. So stuff mm -hmm. like this, I really... Like, I will sit here and look at this tree and, like, pick my path very yeah. early on. Yeah. Um, I just love digging into that stuff. Mm -hmm. Did you like Cuphead, Alex? I loved Cuphead. Didn't beat it. It looks but... like that was an upgrade that Club, I think it was. The Oak Club seemed like it had up and to the left, I think. Wow. The Lethal Club. Yeah, it looks like you could throw stuff back, which might be... We like that. Okay, we'll grab oh, that. Oh, you don't have enough points to unlock it. Or, no, yeah, I did. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. So, let's see. Okay, so there's a disable feature that... I don't. I guess I don't know. I, I I thought it would like allow you to get points back, but it looks like you just maybe. disable it. So I guess I don't know. Maybe just for a like a different type of experience, maybe. But um, it's for the achievements, I bet. Probably. Yeah. I like the experience of having more stuff. Yeah. <laughs> it was like like fun, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, All right, here we go. Let's... I expect perfection now. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh uh, here we go. Triple J says, is this a Mar uh, Microsoft first party game? This is not. This is uh, Microsoft teamed up with a bunch of indie devs to um, make make this week happen. So none of this is first party. Um, um, but we were talking about it on the stream the other day uh, where, you know, I think there is a definite chance that a lot of these could end up on Game Pass, and I think this is a, a testing ground for Microsoft to see, like, you know, what people are playing and what they're interested in. Um, oh, I'm forgetting about the right bumper. There we go. Okay, now we're cooking. Look at him go. Yeah. <laughs> oh. My giant adopted work son. Look at that. Yep. What a maneuver. <laughs> it's amazing. Um. So, is fire a projectile? That's the question. Is fire a projectile? What? Yeah. I, mean, I usually pronounce it projectile, but oh. I, I... <laughs> you thought I'd, I'd pick up on it. it. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, we'll go down here. And what's that little option guy who's following you around? He's uh, he's Blast 32, I'm pretty sure. I think uh, he's your, your little conscious. Or your guide, perhaps. Yeah, I didn't look past the hair. <laughs> yeah. To be honest. <laughs> yeah. You're sitting there like, why would they model a game character? <laughs> Phil Spencer. I don't get it. <laughs> Phil Spector. Phil Spector. Yeah, different. Very different people. Very, very different. Yeah. Very different. I was gonna say. Yeah. Cork, are you a Halo fan? Is there? I think they were a time and place thing. I think certainly very foundational to first-person shooters on console, but I I don't have any enthusiasm for the series going forward. I don't have any like axe to grind with it either, but it's just yeah. vanilla pudding. Yeah. So what are you what are you excited about for for next week, Cord? Or for tomorrow? Excuse me. For tomorrow. Oh, oh my yeah. gosh. Yeah. Freaking tomorrow. I can't believe oh, it. Oh boy. Yeah, I can't believe it either. Uh, this is a, a cop-out answer, but <laughs> I want to see the stuff I don't know about. That's yeah. always my favorite That's thing. That's what you I know? said, yeah. See, I didn't watch the stream yesterday, so you're very smart, Kim. Yeah. <laughs> I like this. Yeah. And I want to see more, uh... surprises, right? We don't yeah. really want those announcements you don't see yeah. coming. Mm -hmm. I want to see some more Yakuza Like a Dragon stuff. 
Hmm. Uh, trying to think of anything else. Yeah, just want to see cool, fun stuff. Would I would like think? a date. I would like a price. Yes. I think both of those The way you just said I would like a date, I was like, wait a second. <laughs> yeah. You're married, but no, you're fine. <laughs> I mean... A lot of... A lot of the chat has been talking about wanting Fable 4. What yeah. do you guys think the chances are that they talk about anything Fable related tomorrow? It's like they almost have to, right? I would think. The chat but says they want it. Yeah. If the chat wants it, the chat's yeah. going to get it, right? Yeah. But um, here's a here's a question. Do you trust a new Fable? Mm. Um, yeah, I'm a monster like that, that I, I, I liked Fable 3. So oh, I don't, know. I, I trust, I don't even trust myself anymore <laughs> with, with Fable. I didn't want like all the spin-offs they had after it that weren't mm. like what Oh like the journey cool. and all that other Yeah. yeah the Connect game. Yeah. 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 Um, the one with the little ragdoll fable character. Yes, yeah. that one. That one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, but I would love the series to kind of return to form and uh, yeah. you yeah. know, see what they could do this uh new gen with it like it had interesting concepts it was fun to just play around in that world and yeah. you know they've since you know xbox and uh 360 and ps3 like level like it's things have just gotten better with what game developers can do with worlds so yeah. imagine yeah. like that and all the activities they could put in and just how fun that would be to explore so yeah i would be happy to see it a fable four yeah I... that's a series too that i feel like the like even at its best it in my opinion it seemed like it was missing something like it was being throttled by something behind the scenes like the worlds weren't big enough you know once the illusion of like oh this is just a big hallway with a you know there's like a texture of woods on the sides yeah but it just seems like it really needed to open up in a way that yeah. maybe the technology didn't allow it at the time for sure i uh i'm a huge i fable 2 is my favorite um I, I didn't hate 3, like a lot of people did, but um, I thought Fable 2 was, was a better one. And I think that is such a, it can be such a pillar franchise for, for Microsoft. Um, and just, there's a level of levity in those games that I think is missing in a lot of a lot of titles these days um, that I'm excited mm -hmm. for, that, that stark British humor. Um, mm -hmm. I'm actually curious, since you guys were in the industry while it was, while it was um, out there, did you guys ever... Um, did you guys actually get to play Fable Legends at any of the trade shows that you guys went to? Yeah. Was it yeah, was it unsavable as Microsoft saw it? It's it, it's difficult because like a demo, the entire purpose is to be fun. <laughs> yeah. Right. So the section that that I saw was fine. It yeah. wasn't like I left you know punching the air or anything like that. Yeah. But it was like an interesting concept it was like the asymmetrical multiplayer right so someone was the, the role of the dungeon master so to speak right and then, yeah yeah then other people were just kind of in the world as the uh that one character kind of throwing things their way yeah it was it was fine it was kind of a weird thing because like it was one of those like does anyone want this i don't i don't know everyone <laughs> yeah, wants like yeah, who us. asked for this yeah me and cork actually saw it at a gamescom together yeah um, okay. way back and I remember playing it and being like, this is fine, but I don't know if anybody really wants this. Mm -hmm. And that was ex mm -hmm. exactly the impression that I was left with. And like, yeah. you kind of feel bad in a sense too, because you're like, they're putting all this work into this game. And I just don't know if there's an audience that really is, you know, pining for it mm -hmm. um, or yeah. even cares in that matter. Yeah. But, yeah. It seemed like a weird series too, because uh, like Fable certainly you know a lot of a lot of fans and everything but it never struck me as like such a wholly original universe that they had enough room to play in where they mm -hmm. needed all those spin-offs because it wasn't exactly. like oh the, i need to learn more about what's going on with this part of the world or whatever it's just like at a certain point you have to kind of pull yourself back and be like what is fable yeah. really is it yeah. just the general art style and color palette or is it the tone where they can't resist any kind of joke about sheep or chicken <laughs> i don't yeah. know yeah yeah, you're playing a game. How is that? Over there? <laughs> oh yeah, a video game. By the way. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm good. I feel like I'm starting to get the cadence a little bit more. I just ran into uh, one of the the merchants in in the the roguelike zone here. Um, can I you don't, buy the gun? I can't buy the gun yet. I only have 59. I can only buy uh, the cucumber. <laughs> Disgusting. Please oh, make well, it. <laughs> well, I mean, apparently you know. I can disappear. That rules. <laughs> 
I, I want you to buy it and then it like does nothing because that would just be awesome. Mm -hmm. I like those trick <laughs> items. So I Makes bought it. Up every once in a yeah. while. Yeah. I don't oh, know. Oh boy! Did if nothing you happen? Hit people with the cucumber. This game's worth nothing. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not seeing a button prompt to do anything with it, no! so I literally think I just wasted 25 blood. <laughs> I told you it was gonna be a fake out. Yeah, that's funny. And now and we know the maybe... developers' the feelings on cucumbers. <laughs> Maybe some kind of a reward down the road. We'll yeah. Oh, possibly. Maybe it yeah, opens the door later. Yeah, someone's going to need a cucumber and you're going to have it. That's yeah. what's going to happen. There we go. Yeah. yeah. Very much the, like, yeah, the, the like the system in, like, Link's Awakening where it's like, <laughs> oh, you have this, like, pot. I needed this. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, no. yeah. Is there any other food that is transformed as much as cucumbers are when they're pickled? Oh, that's a good Because I think, like... I would render, I would say cucumbers borderline inedible. Like, they oh, hate them. Yeah. ruin almost everything they touch because they're so wet yep. and they have a taste that I just cannot handle and it, like, it just seeps and oozes that taste everywhere. Yeah. Pickles, absolutely love them. Yeah. They're, uh, they're the best. Thank you. Thank you, Jeff. Yeah. I feel like yeah. my, because I have people in my family and friends who just love cucumbers. Like, I have never understood why. I think you guys are crazy. I don't get it. Yeah. Um, and do, do they pretend like they're like gonna break your brain when they're like, uh, did you know that uh, pickles are cucumbers? Like, <laughs> like the, oh the yeah, dumbest thank fat you. ever. Thank you. You're uh, not gonna be where that. raisins come from either. <laughs> Unbelievable. Really breaking my brain. I love here. where this conversation has evolved. Yeah. We're really. <laughs> this is what people come for. Exactly. exactly. Yeah. So I'll I'll give this another run or two here, and then mm -hmm. uh, and then we can switch over. Um, but for what you, people, what are you gonna play next? Uh we. Are we gonna do some some Hellheim or some Hellheim? Let's see, some Hellheim hassle. Help! 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 <laughs> um, but I I know we we've kind of we're talking about different things, but I think this game really feels tight, and I'm excited mm -hmm. for people who like Dead Cells to try it. And and yeah. Celeste, I think it's a really good yeah. a really good point by you, Jeff. And and I think this has has some some weight to it. So it um, is super not my jam, but the yeah. controls are really nice yeah like it's very very responsive and yeah yeah you should it, download it it feels like it feels yeah very tight and it feels i think this is technically it's either coming to early access or it is in early access so um don't let my my uh, badness uh <laughs> um steer you away i think this is this is definitely one of the more polished demos that we've we've played so far on on stream yeah. i've heard that it's possible to be really good at this game yeah which <laughs> challenge yourself there you go. And be one of the, the good people. Yeah, I want you to. I want you. Tell to Alex, how it's done. Exactly. <laughs> I want. I want you to tweet at me and be like, "Wow, look how good I am at this game, and you weren't." And I'll yes. be like, "Yeah." All right, sweet. I'll just go on with the rest of my day. <laughs> Appreciate yep. it. But if you posted like a little video clip when you're antagonizing Alex on Twitter, that'd be good, right? I like it. I'm a video guy. I do like it. Yeah. yeah. Look at him go. I'm trying to think. I'm still thinking about the cucumber conversation. <laughs> like, yeah. I like. We're never gonna leave it. I feel like you can like mold like something like Brussels sprouts into, or like cauliflower, or no, like cauliflower into into a lot of different things now. People use cauliflower yeah, for true. like for like w buffalo wings. I think Reeve said he tried that. Mm -hmm. um, but I I still don't hate it on the level of cucumbers. So yeah. Do you like do you like cel do you guys like celery? I feel the same way about celery. Yeah, no, celery is fine. Yeah, celery is literally only made for transporting other foods. I think, mm. like peanut butter, or, bread, or something. Yeah, like it's that. only yeah. good if you can dip it in yeah. something. Yeah, or like yeah, sop up the wing sauce after you're done with it. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Chat, what do you think? Are we out of our minds? Well, I he's mean, dying here. Help him. Yeah. Help Alec. <laughs> You just talked about cauliflower. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not using the heavy strike as much as I need. What, what is the best vegetable? That's a good question from uh, Squid on Twitch. Hi, Squid. Squid, what's up? <sighs> is it just like innately or with some kind of preparation? So like Brussels sprouts oh, here. with a glaze and bacon or something oh. versus just a plain <laughs> For the rest of your life, one vegetable. What vegetable? One vegetable. You only have mm. one shot here. Mm. Oh, God. And can we all agree ahead of time not to be pedantic? Like, 
armchair botanists to be like, <laughs> well, technically that's this <laughs> end of thing. It's not a vegetable. If yeah. you're like just the produce aisle, it's we'll just be generous and kind to each other. Yeah. Cause I would, I, I would say a potato. Would you consider that? I don't, I know it's a tuber, <laughs> which I don't know where that falls within, you know, the whole yeah. hierarchy of vegetables, but yeah, I would say potato probably. I would, I, potatoes are so damn versatile. I think, I think you mm-hmm. got to give it to them. Mm-hmm. Also, so, okay, there's a room with a question mark in it. So I don't know what I missed. Here. It's got a so, secret. In oh, it. there we go. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, so it gives me. I can't read it because I'm going to die, but. Blast is telling me about it here. Let's see. All right, good talk. I was hoping that was going to be health. It wasn't. We're going to move on. Oh. <laughs> I'm at half health, so I'll be okay. Yeah. That's what I'm telling myself. Yeah. Are you bouncing any of the bullets back? I don't yeah. think so. No, it looked like you did. Okay. Maybe, Maybe I did. Let's pretend that you're, that's what you're yeah. doing. <laughs> Developer gets on like, no, we never put that in. I don't know what you're no, talking that was about. a joke. Yeah. That was the cucumber of yeah. weapons. <laughs> now oh, I kind of want to interview these guys and be like, like... What kind of cucumber hurt you? Like to put it in your <laughs> game. You're down to one health, my friend. This is and now I'm down together. to zero. <laughs> okay, I right. I think that's a good look. So that was Scorchbringer. Yep. Uh, really tight controls, really cool art style. Uh, mm -hmm. If you like Dead Cells, if you like Celeste, if you like Super Meat Boy, uh, definitely check this one out. And I think mm -hmm. this one's closer to being out than the others. Um, and also, we don't like uh, it. Helped us establish that cucumbers, no go, not happening. No good. Surprise yeah. cucumber sandwich. It is <laughs> difficult to overstate how, how awful that is. Yeah, it's it's... Like if you slipped a quarter in a sandwich <laughs> without telling someone, I would rather have that. Yeah. Ugh, God. Yeah. Uh, Kim, we go into to Helheim hustle here. Hassle. Let's do it. Let's right. do it. Let's do it. What is this game? What well, am I seeing already? It. Okay. Because that's the thing. This is a game where the cover of it did nothing for me, and I was like, "Ah, uh, I'm gonna." I, I checked it out last, and then I was like, "Why did I wait so long to yeah. look at this game?" It's, it's an update. Awesome. What? It's a demo. Why does it need an update? And you just did you just download it today? Yeah, I literally right I before the right before the stream. <laughs> what is this garbage? Well, unbelievable. All right. Well, I get. We'll come back to it. We'll come back to it. Yeah. Um, oh no. What do you? What do you? What do we want to do instead? Um, panic. Just sheer <laughs> panic. We no, were not anticipating this, point viewers. Point oh no. Click game. The point and click game, like Monkey Island. Okay. Yeah. Darkest Castle. Man, today you can't, you can't even play demos without updates. Day one patches. What's going on here? Back in my day, you used something. to you used to get a disc. And what was mm -hmm. on the disc stayed on there, and that was it. Yep, that game was broken, yeah. tough. <laughs> yeah, we you... that was good actually. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't am I misremembering? Did Game Informer ever send out demo discs? I know, like OXM did back in the day. Yeah, but yep. and OGM, EGM all the officials, EGM. I think they may have had like special. Yeah, gotcha. Things. Okay. All right. Here we go. Darkestville Castle. So I don't know about you guys, but I still love me a good point and click adventure game. Yeah, and absolutely. I'm curious what cat mode one. was. I didn't play. Cat oh, I didn't play. even see that. <laughs> I should have done cat mode yeah. when I played. Yeah. Uh, Mr. Twelve wants to know if you, we will be live streaming the Microsoft conference, which I know Alex has the answers to that for people. Mr. Twelve. Also, welcome to the show. It's good to have you. Um, we are. We are not only doing the show, we are doing the pre-show, and then we're going to do our own post-show GI show special. A lot of shows in there. Um, but yeah, we, we are going to be starting, we're going to go live at about 9.45 Central Time, and, uh, and then watch the Summer Games Fest pre-show and then the, the showcase. So it'll be great. And I missed the start of the story, so... <laughs> Kim, you have to film. Demon baby named Sid right here. Okay. He showed without rest that his demon nature was on. Gotta watch out for those demon babies. <laughs> they are the worst. Chaotic, always causing pain. The problems of others for him. You better make this point in clicking 
exciting, Alex. <laughs> okay. So help me God. I'll rotate the right stick. <laughs> yes, get the, get exactly. The... <laughs> yeah. Only evil Gotta, like, mouse over stuff a little. Ooh, am I gonna <laughs> click on it? Oh, uh, yeah. uh, let's see. Yeah. <laughs> but just keep in mind. Okay. Doesn't have a happy Hold on, we'll get to it. I see a I see a comment that I need to point out here. Uh oh. Mm. Uh oh. In a good way. Well, you can be the judge here. Uh, uh oh. Fan of the show, Dan Snacks. I don't know if we've ever talked about him. Said what you got to do is take pickles and use them as bread and make a stacked sandwich. That sounds Saw that. That sounds like the ruminations of either a genius or a madman. I'm not sure which. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. You hollow it out like it's uh, old school subway bread. Oh, there you go. Yeah, I think that would be too much pickle. Um, too much pickle. Yeah. Uh, Blood Diamond One Eight Seven says, "Will Alex say world premiere before each new announcement? If if they don't have the world premiere guy, I will do it. I'll step in. Microsoft, give me a call. I'm right here. We're looking for someone with a Minnesota accent. <laughs> world premiere, eh? There you, go. you know." They are really a bold move here. Long mm. opening. Yeah. <laughs> to I, I skipped I skip through it. Okay. I it's not it's not disrespectful. We <laughs> we appreciate all the game designers. We talked about it yesterday. Absolutely. You guys have a really hard job. We're so appreciative of it. Didn't mm -hmm. no disrespect. We gotta show the people. However, now. however, we, we want to see your game. We didn't, pay to, we didn't pay to see your name buttons. <laughs> Out of the way, sir. <laughs> now let's see what's on the agenda of Evil tonight. It doesn't move Let's around as quick as I want, but that's okay. Oh, well. Yeah. <laughs> can you... Oh, there we go. Sure. Oh, an hour. Yeah, it's all on there, and you can pick to look at things, talk, um, or grab. Okay. Something that just went by in the background. <laughs> what is... Yeah, is it a giant dinosaur? What's, what is it? Oh, are we on a... We're meant to be on a train? Is that what's happening? Yeah. I don't know. I think it was like a creature. Viewers, what's happening? Yeah, you tell us. And we can expand that just to what's happening in your day. Yeah. If you don't care about this train <laughs> slash tower. What's that? Sounds like Dan Teapot yelling at my door again. This time it Click on the teddy. For real thieves. There's no escape from this. No more Sid the Demon. Yep, that's Dan. Oh, I just totally... <laughs> this, this guy was, like, telling me his life story. I just clicked out of it. Yep. That's Dan the Teddy. Dan the Teddy. I like that. Old enemies, though. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> okay, here we go. Mr. Mr. Buttons. Look at Mr. Buttons talk. Go. I'm gonna talk to him. See what's going on. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Buttons, want to chat? So yeah, that's how you look, talk, or um, <laughs> grab items. Yeah. Okay. And that looks like. Let's see. Can I take a He's nap not here? In the mood. Can I talk? Let's see. Can I talk mm. to my bed? I can't talk. Oh, thank you for for illuminating me here. I don't want a hernia. Fair. That's fair. You can't talk to that. Yeah. Let's look Open in the that door. Get out of this room. <laughs> Let's see what's in the bathroom here. Oh no! Door to my bathroom. I locked it because I have problems sleeping if it's not nice and secure. What about would, that book? Who would come from the bathroom? The book. Toilet monster. What? You never heard of it? That's probably because it's a product of my imagination. I know. I have problems. Ah, he seems like a troubled, troubled that person. Literally, his big book. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Very cool. Read this book. I haven't read the book. I think I need to let it stew a little before you're not talking to that way. Yeah, there we go. He really Sorry, likes his teddy bear, it looks like. Blood Diamond points out I like the skull faces when you select something. Yeah. Let's see. Here you go. If I open the fish tank, is it gonna like attack me? Let's see. I know. Yeah. I don't even know how to get this tank open anymore. Oh, good. Your fish is probably very hungry. That's probably why he's upset. It's my lovely hmm. fish. He doesn't know how to get the tank he knows open. How to do some cool tricks, like act like a fish or splash, but usually it's super ineffective. Hmm. Okay. 
Can I leave? Let's see. Go out to the yard and see what else is going on here. Yes. No, Kit. I see switches. Yeah. Uh, what's? Oh. Oh, this is our friend Dan. I'm gonna go right past him. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Who's this? That's Dan. Oh, I thought Dan was the bear. Uh uh That's Mr. Buttons. Yeah. Be insulting. Actually, chat next time I'll ask you what you want me to answer. That's a lot of options they gave you there. Yeah. <laughs> we feeding into the nerd stereotype, it seems. Okay. Chat, what should I answer? Zang Master says, Do you have an inventory? I. We'll find out after this. You do, it's in that little treasure chest box. I yeah. We need to start picking stuff up. Yeah. It's the only way to solve the puzzles. Alright. Flaming Queso says, bah, forget it. You will never leave this castle again. Yeah, I was just sick of, of Dan's stuff, apparently. Yeah, let's see. And I have nothing in here. So I wonder how that's a... Uh, Wonder how See, I'm guessing gonna... that's where you have your inventory yeah. once you get stuff. Yeah, for sure. Do you guys have a favorite uh, point and click adventure? Maniac Mansion. Okay. Yeah, probably Monkey Island. I like Sam and Max Hit the Road a lot too. Hmm. That one's good. Yeah. Oh, I wonder. Can I like. Oh, okay. Can I. Need the basement key. Wait, there's a chain over there. Goodbye, Dan. Huh. Wait, why isn't this working? And I'm saying over oh, there, like, you know what I mean? On the bike. You know, over there. <laughs> over there. Yeah, over there. Go yeah. over there. <laughs> okay. To the inventory. See if you ah. can grab that chain. There you go. Yeah, it's wrapping around Dan's neck through the door. <laughs> so the, hey, the, the we bars. got something in the inventory. <laughs> I gotta see. So I can use the trap door on Dan. I just need to be able to get into the basement here. But I don't have the key yet. So we'll get the key, go downstairs, and then uh, <laughs> go from there. Um, chat, how about you? What's your guys' favorite... Uh, oh, let's see if it's in the kitchen. Um, it's the door what's your favorite uh, point-and-click adventure? Is this tickling your fancy? Giant rat could escape and bite me. It seems very very dry. Very dry humor here. I'm trying to think through if this is true, but... It, I can't think it like this is his house, right? Mm -hmm. I'm trying to think the beginning of most point and click adventures, you are in a place that is unknown to you, right? Yeah. Because otherwise, if he needed a key to the basement, he would say I, I know where the yeah. this is my house. Why why you know what I mean? Like yeah. hmm. Hmm. I'm trying to think of a of a point and click adventure that does not that has you starting off in your own house, and I can't think of one. Yeah, not off the top of my head here. I'll go back upstairs, see if the key is here. Let's see. Um, Kenneth OD says, Titanic Adventure Out of Time. It's my favorite point-and-click mystery. Plenty of replay and how much or, and how much you might never see in your first playthrough. There you go. Uh, Blood Diamond says the 97 Blade Runner game was very neat. Um... I don't think I've ever played that. Let's see. Zing Master says, what's that spider web on the tank? It looks like it's plugging the hole. Mm, I can go check that out. He doesn't want anything from there. Mm -mm. He's a particular fellow. A gentleman has no so I have a bunch of garbage in my, in <laughs> in my uh, inventory. Did you just get a cane? I did get a cane. Okay, we're, we're getting somewhere. We're getting, I don't, I don't know if it's where we need to be, but we're getting somewhere. Grab the sock too, might as well. Just nope. One. I don't want just one sock. Thimbleweed Park is good. Some of my favorite books. How to be an evil mastermind. Doom and destruction. I'm trying to think and what other, piggies. like I grew up um, on Maniac Mansion and then Day of the Tentacle. Hmm. Um, so I'm more, those are were my favorites. I also was bad and played a lot of Leisure Suit Larry when my parents I don't even know how to get <laughs> oh. <tank> open anymore. <laughs> Very Oops. nice. 
Euro games that kill you yeah. all the freaking time. <laughs> Forgot about Leisure Suit Larry. Release the wolves. Probably a good I thing. I just like that I could get past the child lock, which was answering those five questions that they put in front of the game to get in. Yeah. <laughs> I felt so smart. Yeah. Learned who Spiru Agnew was. Very cool. <laughs> Okay. But yeah, Monkey Island was was really great too. Is there anything back here? Nope, he just or goes. You reviewed right. Broken Age for us, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, that game's great. To open it, I'll... Yes, correct. I also like the the King's Quest reboot that they oh, did yeah. with like old King Graham. I have a, a dog too. I'm not doing anything unsavory. No. Maniacs. <laughs> uh, Okay, that's yeah. enough of that. I was gonna Goodbye. say, I think we're, I think this. Wait, touch the puddle. Oh, I was saying that's enough of the dog squeezing his oh. stupid toy. But oh. <laughs> if you're I looking for like a like... soft out on that too, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's what I meant. Get out of there! I yeah. don't want to play that game anymore. <laughs> Chat, if you guys want to see more, let me know. I don't know where this key <laughs> is. I I think I'm losing interest. Um, you know, I, Cork's point about him being in a house that he probably should know where everything is i think er eroded the the enjoyment for this so yeah. let's see maybe helheim okay will Seriously. work this time let's see if it i can't believe there was an update that's that's that was outrageous <laughs> that's ridiculous yeah <laughs> nothing is sacred anymore yeah did it do it again oh, okay good i was worried so okay <laughs> so now we're playing helheim yep games from perfectly paranormal yep <laughs> They're, they are contribution. They, they are a studio. <laughs> yep. <laughs> they did make this game. Yep. There's a lot of voice acting in this. Is there? Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's got an automatic save game thing, so don't turn your console off when you see this thing spinning. Very cool. Mm. All right. Here we go. Alright. I'm very curious on what this is, Kim. I told you, I was like, it was a weird one that I downloaded, and then I was like, actually, this is kind of fun. Yeah. Oh, you could just be two arms? Alright. can jump. Oh, interesting. I can turn up my mic a little bit. They say they can barely hear me. Okay. I turned you up a little bit too, but yeah, if you want to... If you want to turn it up a little bit, you you can. Turn it up. So they really lean into the you are a Viking, just wanting to kill shit. Okay. Very proud lineage. Yep. Oh man. See, I'll probably see like some more Hellblade. Yeah. <laughs> Tomorrow and then this also. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it'll be an interesting lot, lot pairing. Of, yeah, a lot of health, health yeah. stuff. <laughs> Very cool. <laughs> this probably has a different tone. Very yeah. different yeah. tone. Yeah, it seems yeah. a little, little different, a little out there. Let's see. And there you are. Oh, okay. You want that? Ah, yes, the classic Viking lingo. Mm -hmm. Hi, Helga. Who are we battling? I like I like Assassin's Creed approach, and they're like, Vikings were very, you know, they were peaceful and they they had families and stuff. And this game's like, nah, they just killed everything. <laughs> yep. They're hurling boulders. I guess that's the beauty of art. There can be multiple interpretations. The boulder just flies across the screen. That's how I feel, Helga. I'll you can up. you can take this one. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> we'll catch up. <laughs> <laughs> Some of the animations are really great. It's just goofy, yeah. <laughs> Good luck dying, guys. 
That walking animation, if you do decide to play Welcome to Elk, yeah, uncannily similar. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Find a place in the house to hide. Okay. There You're gonna go. let everybody else die while you hide. Yeah, he doesn't seem like the brave type here. Your strategy going there. Yeah. Mom. My dumb little sword. <laughs> I um. You do want to get brutally murdered in battle and go to Valhalla? <laughs> this right? is a dark. Twi this is. This is interesting. Because remember, all awesome Vikings go to Valhalla. <laughs> but if you're sick, and plain, you're doomed to eternity in Helheim. Yes, okay. Let's see where this is going. Okay, hon. I'm gonna go see if a nice giant wants to slit my throat. <laughs> See you at the battle. To battle! <laughs> I can't stay here. I can't <laughs> Let's see. Guess I'll hide out in the woods until this ridiculous battle <laughs> again. There you go. There we go. Yeah, now we're moving. Is it is it two D like this? I'm just on one like plane? Yeah. Okay, cool. So yeah, there you'll do some light platforming elements. Cool. Climb some shit. Mm -hmm. There you go. Squid O uh, says, oh, this, said, is, this is really something. Like I said, it was not what I was expecting when I yeah. downloaded it. And yeah. I was like, I got, we got to show it off. Yeah, for sure. I'm excited to see what this combat entails. Oh, just you wait. <laughs> they didn't even finish their board. Ugh. Some of them like <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Can I get up? Oh, I say I can go down here. There we go. Do, do, do. Uh, Mr. Awesome says, what is this game called? And it is called Helheim Hassle. From Cork, what was the developer at the beginning? I've since moved on, I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> You're planning the next one. Yeah, the next game. <laughs> uh, I don't think I have any coins, right? No, I don't. No thanks, Ake. I think I'm good. Fine. Uh, but don't come crying to me. I always say yes anyways. Oh, I should have done that. My bad. No, you 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 wouldn't have gotten it. Yeah. I'm curious what am I what do you think this is that I'm climbing here? Looks like scales. It's leaves. My hiding spot is just over like Have you ever seen a tree? Oh, no. <laughs> I closed my eyes outside. Easy. Easy. Oh. I, mean, I get it. They're not always blue. Yeah. Got the raven here. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, this is just going to go great. <laughs> no, don't. He's even got like the angsty teen haircut. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, don't. <laughs> what is this? What is happening? <laughs> oh no, he took the, he took the bear with him. Oh no. Oh poor poor bear. And that was the end. <laughs> yeah. Oh well. I reached the ripe old age of fourteen. That's like. You reached fourteen at least, eh? Hey? Oh, wow. <laughs> like fifteen <laughs> Viking years. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Flaming Case says this, this animation reminds me of Happy Tree Friends or the other Flash animation. Yeah, that's that's pretty accurate. Let's see. All right. Well, let's reattach all your body parts. Yeah. Let's see. Now. Yeah. Like, yeah. Let's find him. I think I see some up there. There's one. Don't think I can okay, I got up. one leg. This feels so weird. <laughs> ah, yes, the classic Viking tale of of uh, finding your body parts. I think I remember Corey Barlog talking about this is what they wanted to do God of War about, and then they they changed course. Yep. Went a different direction. That's yeah. fine. Yeah. Teach their own. Oh, there's one all the way up there. Can't die, right? Yeah, I was gonna say. If if, if I like, if they put some fall damage in here, I'm gonna be upset. If he's a ghost. Okay. 
hear someone talking over here. Let's see. Okay. There. You got this. There we go. Look at that. Reattach that arm. Yeah. But you're being called a wimp at the same time. I was going to say, I'm not going to stand for that. Oh, speaking of fable, yeah. <laughs> oh, there. Talk to that thing. Was your soul teleported here? I don't think so. I just died over there. Hmm. All right. Cause of death. I cowardly fell to my death. <laughs> hmm. Nah, this doesn't seem right. You don't look sick, old, or lame to me. <laughs> what? I just told you I accidentally fell to my death. That's super lame. Shut up. <laughs> Says here that you're a brave hero. Now get out of here before he That's not an acceptable way to die. Who is he? What the hell is happening? Someone's playing tricks. Who could it be? Hello, friends and foes. <laughs> it's me, your old father. And welcome to another episode of Why Was Moodkin Talking with My Soul? Uh, I, I didn't know he was your soul, oh father. He, he approached me. Is that so? <laughs> Play it forward. Gaming says Odin. More like, oh damn. <laughs> uh, totally. <laughs> He's oh, making you pinky uh, promise. <laughs> that seems oh. rude. <laughs> if I had pinkies. I'm sorry. I forgot what I was doing. Was I about to she doesn't have a pinky. Uh, no. Very well. Noble warrior. Look. You! Oh, you! You just slew an entire oh, bear! Oh, I see. With your bare hands! Oh, boo! <laughs> Dad <laughs> jokes. Oh, father! Woo! <laughs> Top notch comedy! And you! Child! Ugh! You are eligible to duke it out with me and my bros in Valhalla every single day! Uh, the hassle truly becomes uh, apparent. Don't mess with my soul. Or do and die! Okay. Perfectly paranormal, that's what you were gonna say, Jeff. Yep. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> Right. Now we're going to see the game, right? Yeah. <laughs> we're, I would hope we're getting there. Yes, now you are going to learn how to take off your body parts. Okay, cool. Also, shout out to Steel Cobra. Watching on Mixer. I think this is like Mixer's last day? Yeah. I, I think it's a, this week. Oh. Yeah. A heartbreaking time to be a Mixer. Yeah. So, shout out to shout out to Steel Cobra, though. And, and Tor Bomb, if he's watching on Mixer. and. Yeah. The whole gang. Where the gosh darn is it? Ouch! Ah, stay away from me, you stupid bush! I'll kill ya! Whoa! Very much a blending of, of time periods here. Man, how is this place so gosh darn cold? cold? It ain't even winter yet! Now, where is that stupid gate? Oh, Torbomb says, we on Twitch now. Good to have you on Twitch, Torbomb. Sent to pick something up for my boss today. <gasps> hey, I think your gate's frozen shut. Hello? Hmm. Open up, gosh Hello. darn it. It's freezing out here. Right, demo. Yeah. <laughs> you show us. What? What's going on here? <laughs> what does that mean? I can't read Norse code. Listen, huh. if I don't I definitely when we started planning the stream, I thought we would and it would be a I matter of like getting to the end of these too quickly. And now all these demos are showing me that no. <laughs> We're gonna give you hours of content here. Whether you like it or not, you're gonna get yeah. hours of content. Yeah, I think I've got a hard out at like four AM. Yeah. <laughs> so you know. Okay, good to know. We'll be here all night, right? Yeah. Yeah. You people are ruining my life. Alex, I can't believe you didn't like acknowledge that Norse code joke. I I saw it and I was just like, I can't acknowledge. I, can't, I need to move on from, from this. Yeah. Don't worry, you just gotta get Let's through see. this guy talking. Oh, and okay. Pretty, you're into no. the gameplay. Okay. From what I played earlier. Cool. How does he do it? 
I like to laugh. I I laugh easy sometimes, but I'm not. I don't How give it up for everything. No. No, not everything. Oh. All you have to do is throw paper at a dead body. <laughs> I'm learning so much. Ah, what the hell is going All on? you need to do, folks. Where am I? Yeah. Who are you? Holy gosh, darn it! It worked. Uh, are you okay? Can you see me? Wait, of course you can. <laughs> Duh. Hey, man. Name's Pesto. Hmm. I, I Classic Norse name of Pesto. What is happening? Yep. Huh. Did you just get me out of El Hala? So yeah, now are you're you, gonna get into some Listen, of the like. I don't want to go into puzzles. all the ins okay. and outs of the situation. Cool. I'm just trying to go to Viking Hell, and this stupid gate ain't letting me. Just tell me what it says, and I'll uh, I'll send you a gift basket or something. Viking Hell? You mean you're trying to go to Hell? There we go. Heil Heilheim. Jeez, I can barely pronounce mm. it. Hmm. They've changed it. It says they changed it? What the home does that mean? No, they changed the game. It just Interesting says, though that seriously, Curry, uh, just push the Barlog did keep the skeleton one character button? has to translate You're from another character element from this original design gate. concept. Yeah. I'll show you. Woo! I'll see if I can find a skeleton button. Those gates. I mean, anything is Let's better see. than being in Valhalla. All right, just hurry up. <laughs> I'm not really supposed to resurrect people. Let's see. <laughs> I, uh. Let's see. Um. Sounds, uh. I. I mean, Lee, uh. Lee Fion, uh. Says, sounds like a, a bad early Ash Ketchum impression. Hey, yeah, it's Pesto. pretty. It's pretty good. Did anything happen to the gate? Nope. Here you go. Let's smash it open with a rock. So, this is where you're gonna learn now. Gosh, okay. It. Hold on. Eventually, we have to. Have to, uh. <laughs> to. To that combat something, right? To this unnecessarily narrow hole. Well, I but if you get there, off it, I don't handle narrow spaces very well. I don't think I can fit in there, Pesto. Then what are you good for, you little? Ah! Oh, wow! Wow! <laughs> what the? Oh, that's. Oh, that's <laughs> what the hell I mean, that does it. Do me, Pesto? Yeah. How am I still alive? I um. Uh, I might have messed up the resurrection spell. Look, it ain't a big deal. Once I send you back to, what did you call it? Wall Howler? You'll be mm. fine. Great. So I'm just ahead then? Hey, at least okay. now you can Okay, now we're rolling out, here. Right? I guess. Yes. So you There's can like separate parts of your body. In here. Okay. So like, you, you want to put the, yeah, you can go through there with the then? head. I ain't a physical cool. being, dummy. Now it's gonna push it, tell you mind. that. <laughs> it's oh, fine. Yeah. I'm coming back. Wait, here's a crazy idea. Can you still uh, move your weird headless body? Um. Okay. Wow, you can. That's so there we go. So yeah, our okay. feet. No, the you can swap between them. So kind of oh. like Sweary's the missing, where you could remove different body parts okay. to get around. Yeah, I'm with it. So right. yeah, you're. You're going back and forth between that and hitting different powers. switches and trying to get around these okay. small little you puzzles. Have fun in there. Cool. Never dead. The game from last gen that also had a similar cutting your parts off <laughs> mechanic, or as you took damage, parts fell off. I it could be misremembering. I don't know if I played it. Unfamiliar. Remember, if, that, if it's the one I'm thinking about, Helgeson reviewed it, and not a fan. No. <laughs> So you can also like jump higher if you have the head off, um, so you can make jumps you wouldn't have been able to before. Okay. There we go. Oh. Kind of a fan of this game. What are you doing? Today? You are. Kim is. Oh yeah. What? You're a big fan of this game. A big fan of this game. Yeah. I think it looked interesting and fun. You're being helpful. Yeah. I'm not yeah. saying anything oh, mean. Oh, oh. oh I'm no. being helpful because no. I played it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, you've been you my guide through stuff. this. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, I played a lot of Swearies that the myth scene, and I really liked hey, that game a lot. Um, which has, like I said, a similar just concept. Because I'm cool. a skeleton, I'm Breaking off those here? body parts and then putting them where they need to go to get you around. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this fella had a, had a tough time here. Sorry, friend. Hey, remember how no. you can jump higher without your head? I feel like that's really important somehow. Roll through here. 
Can I... Let's see. There we go. Oh, look at this all-star. Oh, yeah. Now I'm starting to get it, man. It's starting to click now. Three's greatest geniuses, <laughs> Alex. Uh, said my mom, maybe? <laughs> Question mark? Even she, I don't think, would, would bless me with such hey, high praise. You better not be running off somewhere, because that could cause me a ton of problems. Okay. Throw the head. That's a good question. Oh, okay. Oh, maybe you have to throw it in the water over there. Let's see. What? So I can yeah. drop it? Doesn't look like I can throw it. But if I want to... Okay, hold on. Ignite there. Wait. Interesting. Okay, this mechanic is... Okay. Nope. Jump higher without it. Yeah, so then put him there. Oh, but is then, there a way? see, but then, no. Is Why would I? A... Yeah, what was the purpose I wouldn't, of yeah, that? Unless it's, oh, okay, I can swing over with one hand. Let's see. Oh. And then crawl up this way. That's yeah. It. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Fell fell ass backwards into that one, but it worked. Oh, there we go. Yeah. On to the yes. next puzzle. Finally. Look at this. So, in your experience with it, was it more platforming like this, or is, is there actual combat a little bit later on? I didn't get to any combat. I actually stopped around this point okay. when I played it. So, when I read it, it said narrative slash puzzle okay. game. Um, so, I don't know if there is. It seemed like he doesn't. This oh, guy doesn't. no! <laughs> Whoa. I fell real far on that one. We're okay. We're good. I was gonna say if I fell all the oh, way no. down, maybe it's time to time to switch it up. But yeah, no, we can switch to something else. I just thought it seemed like a yeah. cool concept. Um, you know, the jokes were, were little, hit or miss. Little, little silly. I yeah. think the jokes are trying. They're trying really hard. They are so. trying. That's for sure. You never crack it up, Alex. You yeah. should have heard yourself. <laughs> so good. Oh yeah, someone clip that for me. Show me how good of a time I was, <laughs> I was having. The super cut. Yeah. <laughs> But wait, you know, wait, it, looked, it looked what? interesting. Yeah. Just let me see it. Yeah. I'll, we'll get out of the scene and then, uh, and then we can, I think we can I've find something new. All that spelunking. Hmm. All right. One quick look. But you can forget the, the noir game just as a palate cleanser. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I, I'm really Bork excited really for you. To, this. I really want Alex to play this. Okay. Okay. We'll we'll switch it up then. So that was Helheim Hassel. I, uh, and they're walking through there's, like there's some things there. Gate. <laughs> a there's a lot of things there. There's some things there. There are some things there. From Alex. Yeah. That's going to be on the box. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Genesis Noir. Now, I initially picked this out because the style of it looked amazing. It looked really cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mm -hmm. haven't got a chance to touch it. Jeff has mm -hmm. played it. Jeff is excited for me yep. to play it. Yep. So, <laughs> we'll see what this entails. All right, let's see. Uh, I'm curious to see your your amount of, the amount of tolerance for this. Okay. <laughs> if that's how we're starting. Yeah, that's good. We like we like hearing tolerance out of this. this. Yeah. <laughs> let's see. Okay. Scene scenes stands to reason. Because mm -hmm. the the elevator pitch for this is like you're there at the Big Bang. We'll see from here. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, that's all the that's all you'll need. <laughs> Electrons and protons once heat arrivals. You can create the first. Okay. So I would assume the game makers here are not creationists. Mm -mm. No. I guess it's a fairly safe <laughs> assumption. Safe assumption here, yeah. Or at least not young Earth creationists. Yeah. <laughs> not to put too fine a point on it. Yeah. All right, go, Alex, go. Boy. I can't. I can't move or hit A. Hop two. Figure it out. <laughs> go. 
Oh, okay, no. there we go. Now we got getting, it. I'm getting bored. <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> oh, am I like tuning a radio here? What is? Okay. Oh boy. Okay. Getting the tunes going. Okay. This isn't the whole thing, right? Is me just tuning things? No. <laughs> okay, good. What Wait. Even? Wait. Didn't, <laughs> Cork nothing, is enjoying this too happened. much right yeah. now. <laughs> <laughs> what, ha what have you... I guess yep. I brought this game up, but... Yep. What have you done? Am I trying to, like, align it? Just like sync them up? I think it's to the right a little bit more. You were close, but you whizzed past it. Okay. It's pretty precise. Keep going to the right a little more. Coach Cork. In my excitement oh. here. Okay. It is really not aligning <laughs> in no, how I want it to. a little more to the left. It's, you can, it's not, you're not trying to align it. You just want it to be smooth. Oh, okay. Smoothish. That's, that's as good as that one gets. Yeah. Okay. The smooth flow of the galaxy. I get it. <laughs> what? This is a weird, really strange way to open a game. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wild Samurai says, made in dreams. Oh. That chugged a, <laughs> chugged a little bit here. What is happening? What am I? It, it's just a planet? Like, what is, what is it? <laughs> what do I do with it? Okay. All right. Well, that was, that was insightful, I suppose. <laughs> this is trippy. I was like I'm going far too fast here. Uh. Let's see. Okay, getting into the city here. Mr. Twelve points out it's a video game, astute, <laughs> very astute. Okay. Oh, he's shower! Oh no! Can't look at that. He's showering. <laughs> You're just creeping around on yeah. Earth. Oh, yep. steamy. Little little peck in here. We started uh, <laughs> we started uh, yesterday's stream off with some some hot haven action too. Andrew, we don't even know what we're watching <laughs> right now. Yeah. I think that's but part what of, the is the fun? Name of this game again. This is a. Uh, Genesis Noir. How far did you get in this cork? Or was this it? A little more to the right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think okay. the visual stuff is really interesting. Yeah. And cool. Another, it just another, makes yeah. you kind of sit there and figure out what the heck's going on. Yeah. Okay. Another point and click adventure here. Go up the stairs. The visuals hold up, but Yeah, that's that looks I don't cool. really know what I'm playing. Nope. <laughs> you just don't get it, man. You're not <laughs> I'm not cultured enough. Yeah. Huh. I got it. I feel like we've hit that a lot today of games that I'm just not quite there on. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I mean, it's hard when you get thrown into a demo and you're just trying to figure <laughs> stuff out. Yeah. So, um, you know, hmm. I think there's interesting things at play here. It's just yeah. trying to get... <laughs> The, the... Once it all clicks in your brain, it's fine for me. It just takes me a few seconds, and then once I'm like, oh, okay, that, yeah. that's what I'm supposed to do. Yeah. yeah. It can be rough when you first step into any new demo or game. That guy's got the Helheim syndrome, too. <laughs> yeah, where you see? his head's saying, hanging yeah. off with a thread. He's looking at me weird. Yeah. Okay. 
we've we've ran we've ran the uh, the gambit uh, quite a bit today with uh, visual styles here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the... we definitely have. Yeah. You got pixels. <laughs> you got polygons. You got flash flash games, and you got this. Yeah. What more could you want, Chad? That's yeah. what we're here for. What do I? It's a lot of pushing and pulling. I do like the music. Um, yeah. Being so like intricate to the experience. Yeah. Hmm. And just thanks to the setup of this stream, I'm not hearing any of it. So, <laughs> yeah, so, I mean, that's we, cool. We, 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 I wanted you guys to experience it without its strongest, uh, its yeah. strongest uh, asset here. Mission accomplished. Yeah. Are you playing the violin? I uh, oh. stand up bass here. Oh. Let's see. Yeah, right, that's not a violin. Wow, am I tired. <laughs> I wasn't going to say anything. Well, guys, You don't, hey, you don't know how big real. that guy is. It yeah. could be a violin. <laughs> yeah, that's true. He could just be little guy, big world. Exactly. Jeez. Mouse on the motorcycle style. Yeah. <laughs> Every time, I, I will not have one stream where I don't say something asinine. Sorry. I mean, <laughs> yeah. That's what streaming is for, man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, you can make big money <laughs> off of that. Mm-hmm. Are you guys dueling back and forth? I think it's, yeah, I think it's, we're, we'll start to get the melody together. Making music together? Yeah, just like jazz, Pretty man. Cool. Yeah. Fun fact, do you guys know that Ryan Gosling actually saved jazz in La La Land? Oh, I wasn't paying attention for that, damn it. <laughs> Thanks for nothing. Yeah. <laughs> he's going to have to play it again. I totally didn't watch it at that point. He's like, nah, man, that ain't it. That it looks ain't like it chief. stutters quite a bit, so I know these games are early, um, and they're still getting the kinks figured out. Yeah, yep, and and that's something Microsoft has said when they they announced all these was, um, you know, that expect this to be, you know, these are works in progress. So you know, uh, some of these devs have have a little ways to go still. And... Yeah, and you're playing on a launch. Xbox One, too, right, Alex? I'm playing on Xbox One X. That was. I just wanted to be a little snarky. Yeah, a little snarky. <laughs> That's shocking. You've never. I've never heard you. You snark anything. That was. That was for you, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's nodding. Nope. And now he's not happy. Uh. Oh, you heard the jazz. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't like what you're doing. Which is fair. I don't know if I do either. I think I think maybe it's time to to, to move on here. You um, stood, you you played a lot longer than I thought you would. Yeah, I was gonna say I beat the court right. the, the office it record. Got, it got cool. It got cooler as it went on. Yeah, honestly. and I will say the the visual style is still very interesting. So if someone in chat mm -hmm. wants to keep going and let me know what we're missing out on, let me know. But that yep. was Genesis Noir. Okay, what are we? Send a video to? clip of of you beating the. <laughs> The stand-up bass player in the boss battle. <laughs> yeah. You just trample him with the trombone or the uh, the saxophone. Oh, Alex. Oh, I know. I know. <laughs> trombone versus violin. I know. <laughs> the streams, the streams get long. We're doing great today. We're showing our music chops yeah. here. Yeah. All right. What uh, What are we thinking next, gang? What What sounds good? Do we want to do Dandy Ace? Uh, Kaz? Kaz? Yeah. Is that one? Okay. Do the K1. Okay. The K1. And the Wild Masks. Yeah. So this is very much, um, it is a platformer that is heavily influenced by things like Sonic and Donkey Kong Country. Um, Ooh. So I got to play it for a little bit. And yeah. um, it controls very solidly. Um, you know, if you're if you're hankering for a uh, platformer um, on Xbox, I uh, I think you'll wow. maybe be interested in this, so we'll see. Um, you know, it's very it doesn't do anything crazy new, um, that's for sure. But let's uh come along. Let's, here we go. Let's see what's going on here. Also, d in games in game demos, do you need extra like save slots? Multiple well, saves. Yeah, that is interesting. Huh. I've seen that now. Tw I think we've done that like twice. But. I would bet they're not building a game just to be a game demo, Alex. Wow. Pervasive That's thought. That's my, my thought. Yeah. 
You should work in games. I don't know if anyone's told that to you. They said, we need dumb, obvious ideas. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Of course, you're a man. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Are you a big platformer guy, Alex? Yeah, I love a good platformer. I am a Metroidvania Vania fan in that same vein as well. Um, I, uh, I I get excited for any type of Mario. I'd love to see. I'd love to see what they're doing with Donkey Kong these days. Um, yep. But yeah, they, there's the only real genre. I'm sure there's more, but strategy games are not my forte. Not smart enough for them. Um, I'm trying to think, those are the the only real games that I, I don't play a ton of. So. Are you a big DDR fan? <laughs> I did used to get down on that plastic mat, yeah. trying not to <laughs> slip and eat, eat shit on the on the rug. Yeah. When like Game Works was around, they put the out of order sign when you come close to the machine, <laughs> like, the no, circling. I just imagine this like giant tall man yeah. doing yeah. the DDR. <laughs> <laughs> Stomping through to the floorboards. <laughs> oh, great. Oh, oh. Like, oh, no. It's broke He's again. Going for it. yeah. He's going for it. <laughs> Close down the bowling alleys with that. Oh, this looks yeah. cool. Yeah. Yeah, pixel art style. Mm-hmm. Kind of got like a shinobi scarf mm -hmm. thing going on with your ears and yeah. scarf. Alrighty. I was really into the fact that the enemies that you're fighting in this level, as you'll soon see, Kim, follow a theme that I think is fun. <laughs> yeah. Alex we'll and I are sworn to secrecy. We can't tell. We're under embargo. We ah! I'll tell you. <laughs> Very Sonic, like. Mm -hmm. I think it's going for a certain aesthetic with uh, with what we're seeing here. Are you killing vegetables? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, yes, you are! Yeah. Giant carrot! <laughs> I'm into it. Yeah. Yeah. No no potatoes yet, so I don't know what that means about our, our thoughts mm -hmm. about potatoes earlier. Yeah. Do you get to fight a cucumber? Because I think that would make Ooh. all your dreams Ooh, come true. I hope so. <laughs> yeah, our developer friends uh, over in the first game would be very happy. I like it. Let's see. Yeah, it's very playful. This actually does look really cool. Yeah. Down a little bit. This. I tried this bonus stage 15 times this morning. I didn't do it. <laughs> Fingers <laughs> bleeding. No, 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 no pressure, Alex. No pressure at all. Yeah, it's impossible. I'm convinced. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Cork, you have to hand over your gaming license. <laughs> This next series of jumps impossible. So good luck. <laughs> you can't do it. I do appreciate the checkpoint. Oh yeah, you gotta have a checkpoint. Got it. I don't want to do your stupid nonsense <laughs> twice. No way. <laughs> no sir. No. <laughs> I know that we're not supposed to talk about games on the other platform, but I'm playing Ghost of Tsushima right now. Yeah. Very generous checkpoints. I love it. Yeah. It emboldens. Yeah. I like. I like a really generous checkpoint because then, especially in open world games. I could just go, what would happen if I approached this like a complete brainless maniac? And then you'd go, oh, okay, that, that failed almost yeah. instantly. But it was fun yeah. to try. Yeah. Kind of takes uh -oh, away that another stress. Bonus stage. Yep. Don't blow it. Don't blow it, buddy. <laughs> Piece of carrot cake. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll resign wow. tomorrow. I'll Look resign tomorrow. Yeah. yeah. Yikes. Actually, I would play this game. This is a good before bed game. I have games that I'm just like, when yeah. I want to unwind right yeah. before the day ends. I like a good platformer. Yeah. You'd be good on the Switch. Yep. You have a favorite platformer, cool. Kim? Um, so I'm always, I'm going to get shit for this. That's but, okay. Um, it's not, I'm always going to be a big Kirby fan. I like Kirby. I like Dreamland. Uh, but I mean, I like I started out on like the hard when Kirby was hard, not when they made him very easy. So like, not this <laughs> kids crap. Yeah, not this kids crap. Yeah. Um, <laughs> that first one, I love when you had the crane machines where you pick up the extra lives mm -hmm. on the Kirby. But, yeah. Um, I'm been playing right now before bed sometimes a uh, Yoshi's uh, Woolly World. Oh, cause... are you liking it? Yeah. 
I don't think I, I, I haven't picked that one up. Crane minigames, like back in the days of pixels and before physics, <laughs> I loved them, but yeah. they're hard to go back to, at least for me, just because you know that it's just some invisible formula that's getting hashed out in the background. And, yeah. Like, it's not related necessarily to positioning, because they always do the thing where it, like, wiggles at the last second and falls. Yeah. Alex! I know. I was waiting for you guys to, to, to catch up to that. I didn't even want to acknowledge it. It was disgusting. <laughs> Awful. So, I think you Rain and I. Man as well. Yeah. Um, platformer. We haven't had a new Rayman in a long ass time. Yeah, yeah, I was just thinking about that. And obviously, we all know Mario slapped, so. Oh, yeah. I don't even know if you like I have to say that. <laughs> yeah. I, uh. Especially what they did with, with Origins and Legends. I was. I, I love the, that, that take on that series, and I thought yeah. that was so fun. I miss I miss UB art just in general because I really like Ch Ch Child of Light, um, um, the the Rayman games. Um, what was the obviously not enough to remember exactly the title, but um, Valiant Hearts. I really yeah, like the, that, that whole series. Oh yeah, that was, but, yeah. They were yeah they did a lot of cool ones. Yeah, I I always kind of hope they're coming back um, when Ubisoft does a does like their forward events, but uh, to no avail. Okay. Okay, you're gonna you're gonna say Alex, you're bad. I that was a controls thing. I hit the right button. Oh, yeah. It happens. It happens. Are you using wireless or are you plugged in? I am. I'm using my play and charge kit. So. Okay. Or it's just my big dumb fingers, and I refuse to okay. take responsibility. Either way. What did I What did I say earlier? We all die. We all. Yeah, it man. Happens. It happens. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay, You're generous with the heart. Appreciate that. Boop. They seem to Boop. exist just to make your life <laughs> worse. Yeah. <laughs> Those little spiky guys. So do you guys try to collect everything when you play a platformer? Due to a certain point. Yeah. Like the first time I miss like four or five things, then it's like, yeah, forget it. Yeah. So what? The Mario on Wii. We, which one were could you could play with other people? Um, oh yeah, yeah. So me and my fiance Odyssey. tried, yeah, tried playing that together, and we cannot because we have two different play styles. He likes to run as fast as he can through everything, <laughs> yeah. and I need to collect every freaking goddamn thing. I cannot let a coin go yeah. or any little piece of anything, and so he would run ahead and freaking kill me <laughs> as I'm trying to go get the special treasure that's underneath this and. Um, I always laugh because everybody's got different play styles for platformers, but I need to collect everything because it'll haunt me. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you think? Oh, was that the new Super Mario Brothers one? That's the one you were playing? Yeah, together? yeah. Yeah, the one on yeah. Wii. Yeah. yeah. I was thinking originally it was the uh, oh. Galaxy, was it? Where the second player could be the little oh, cursor? Like, sure. Oh, no, yeah. no. The one where yeah. you actually could yeah. play together. You like, are I, a I didn't yeah, realize how different we played platformers yeah. that day. Yeah. Um, it was like, woof. The same good. So we had to stop. Mm -hmm. We couldn't play together. Just... Oh, that one too. You could like antagonize the other player like by running him off the stage. And yeah, exactly. In that weird bubble. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and then I was such a, I'm such a good aunt where I set my nephews up to play it all together. And that, let me tell you, that went off uh, real well. Oh God. Yeah. <laughs> no. But. Alex, buddy. Taking the L. Yeah. Thank God for that checkpoint, though. This game's hard as nails, yep. and only the toughest can get past stage one, two. <laughs> In the demo. In the demo, too. Oh, no, Alex. <laughs> this is this is them saying, we want you to buy the game. Yeah. <laughs> Except for you. You don't get to, Except Alex. Yeah. I'm, I'm so sorry, sir. We yeah. offer cat mode. You don't know what that is. <laughs> well, there we go. That was just brazen, too, how you walked past that big gem. Yep. I just want to complete this level now. It is yeah. those spiky guys that keep getting you. Yeah, I don't time. like them. And that smug little smirk on their faces, mm -hmm, too. They know. What are they supposed to be? I don't know. Yeah, I was going to say, they don't really match the fruit vibe, do they? I guess like a... Uh, what do you call those things? Uh, oh, bonus. Someone stick. in chat probably knows. Yeah. There's like, like a thistle. Is that what it is? Like a... Because you can eat them if you boil them first. I think. Mm. I'll take your word for it. Yeah. yeah. 
They just make it. Yeah, some nasty freak. <laughs> Oh, now they're making you go face to face with this dude. What was the point oh, of this yeah. encounter? What are you trying to do? I'm here? trying to get the other half of whatever that yes. crystal is. Uh, oh. So, all right. But we're moving on. <laughs> Alex has had enough. <laughs> Just, I'm trying to give everyone the best possible look at this game. You know? uh -huh. yeah. I'm thinking of I'm thinking yeah. of our audience who has has stuck with us at this point. So thank you. I appreciate that. You're fine. This is a. This is I'm I am having fun with this. So. It it controls solidly. Yeah. You say is you're cracking the controller <laughs> in your hands. Yeah. I'm having fun. I I I prefer to die a bunch actually. Yeah. I like <laughs> like it this way. Yeah. <laughs> um Corley uh Stromboli, Stromboli says uh chestnuts? Is that what you're thinking of Cork? No, I wasn't thinking of chestnuts, but I don't think I've seen a chestnut in its natural state. I've seen like the the nut part yeah. that you eat. I'll accept it. Sounds good. It's been allowed. Oh, 30 tree. There we go. Now does the wind affect your character? <laughs> no, it does not, thank God. Okay. <laughs> what the heck? I was <laughs> that, that is rough. <laughs> was that a tomato shooting like I don't know what it was shooting out of like <laughs> a lettuce wrap, but yeah. I think that's what we got here. I think the fact that the carrots you fight have arms uh, Where are you shows that this isn't a canonical there? look at the fruit. Yeah. Vegetable scene, so. Ooh. Sexy thing. What? Got a little bird action going here. Yeah. You're a bird! Yeah. Oh, he's shooting. Hold on, I need to observe this. Is he shooting. Chat, what is this? Like a little carrot? Baby carrot? Yeah, it looks like a baby carrot. Huh. Oh. Well. I don't think that's how they behave in real life, but whatever. <laughs> whatever. Neither here nor there. Can I attack the green things here? Oh! Now, when I played the demo of this, I didn't die, so I don't know how this works, but Alex, do, how, <laughs> many, how do you tell when you're gonna die? Is it just like, when you, if you get hit while you're flashing still, or you have like a... Oh god, Alex. normally on the screen? What, I think it was... How does it work? A health isn't on the screen, but it looks like, um... It's unless you get another heart, it's two. Like your shield okay. breaks and then your life breaks. Okay. Where do I start? Okay. Go. Oh, sweet lord. <laughs> <laughs> I hate this. This sucks. <laughs> Look at him go, though. Wow. Viewers, you're really experiencing something special right now. It's the master at the top of his game. <laughs> Look at that. You see that? Once in a generation talent, folks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah Speedrunners. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you need weed. a call. Game's done quick. <laughs> yep. I was worried it was going to crash there, but we're good. Did not yeah. crash. You got it. Yeah. Oop. You got all the, the platforming trappings here. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Yeah. I do wish they would indicate a little bit better where your health is at. So yeah, now, now I've lost my okay. shield, and now it's I'm dead. Thing. Yeah. Thank God for a checkpoint. Okay. All right, we'll give this another shot, and then, uh, we're kind of getting close to the uh, the end of the stream here. Do Jeff, um, Kim, do we want to show one more game, or do you think this is a good closer? We should throw one more game. Okay. But make it a good one. Okay. Oh boy. It's got to be the best of the best. Okay. I do have Warzone downloaded. Does that count? <laughs> okay. Here we go. It's a lot of pressure, Jeff. <laughs> I'm, yeah. I'm nervous now. Yeah. Uh, what was that? You just threw. It's it... like it's like their shot that oh. she has, but. Oh my lord. Our, our friends here. Are you watching this, people? Look at it. It's amazing. There we they go. said it couldn't be done. <laughs> they sent this demo saying, <laughs> "Yeah, this if can't be done." Can beat this, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you'll win a million dollars. Wow, this is my Charlie and the Chocolate Trust Factory us. moment. This is your golden <laughs> ticket. <laughs> yeah. You're gonna regret missing that A. Yeah. My OCD. Bill Spencer's gonna call you up by name tomorrow. <laughs> it's gonna be like, and just specialist, a young man by the name of Alex St Alex S. Ale from Minnesota. <laughs> the thing I've always wanted to fill, fill to recognize me, and it's Alex uh, 
Spatnik, uh, completed the game. <laughs> Can I talk about Battletoads yet? <laughs> you idiot said you wanted it, and we gave it to you. <laughs> and it we admit it sucked so hard, but you said you wanted it. So, happy, you little worms. You <laughs> Oh my god. Alright. Oh no, we went too far back on that one. Here we oh go. No. Alright. Here we go. Oh, oh <laughs> no! <laughs> one last game. Dang it! Uh, let's see. Uh, do we want to, Kim, do we want to end it on your uh, ephemeral tail? Uh, or Dandy Ace? Let's do, we haven't done Dandy Ace. You were, you were high on that, right? Um, I think that'll be an easy one to close with. But... Okay. I just right. thought it was different from what oh. we have already <laughs> We've had a lot of different today. I know. I can never yeah. tell. Yeah. If... This is inspired by the Waluigi genre, apparently. <laughs> Very cool. Where? <laughs> <laughs> I was kidding. Maybe, like, is there any Persona vibes, or is it just me not knowing Persona? Hmm? Nothing going on? Okay. What? Oh, this is you guys really are cool. This is really I love little. those little guys. This is Jeff Quirk, by the way. I love yeah. it. Yeah, I'm the little baby boy. Oh, wait, am I that guy? The green page boy? <laughs> hey, wait a minute. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> Unbelievable. The audio in this is so low. Yeah, I can't hear it at all. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Break the illusion. Viewers, I can't hear anything that's happening. So, like, if I don't, if something... Like, if this could be all fart soundtrack and it's like the funniest, <laughs> coolest thing ever, and I'm just straight facing it, I can't hear it! <laughs> I wish it was all farts. That'd be great. Yeah. Okay. Chat, let me know about if that's better. I literally have cranked it fully on my, <laughs> on my um, mixer here. I'm into this so far. Though. Looks like I kinda, he's great. I'm warmed up to him now. He's like a. Yeah. He, W for Wendetta. <laughs> Mashup. He's coming to get you. Inside the cursed mirror. <laughs> so those little people that look like little circles for heads and just like a shaft for body, those grow up to be those other people? <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. are those what... Yeah, Are they the same species even. I'd hate to see them in their like, their adolescence and, and they. Yeah, we saw the, the the pupil stage, and then they turn into that yeah. handsome devil. Yeah. Let's see if Dang. I can turn the audio up here. Okay, can good. There we go. Well, that should be good. Okay. Should you heard something? Yeah. <laughs> Wait. I mean, it must be going through your headphones or something. <laughs> Probably. It's so loud, good grief. All right, here we go. All Guys, right. this is going to be good. I have no concept. We apologize for, for everything that happened before. <laughs> it was a oh disaster. <laughs> We're so sorry. Hey, man. I had some fun. Hey. Yeah, it was great. Yeah. Matt Miller wasn't here to steer the ship. No. <laughs> this is what we had to make do. Today's stream <laughs> took a much different tone or a turn, but that's okay. Look, Okay. Mysterious guy. <laughs> Just call him Waluigi, it's okay. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> Nickel Canvas says Cork is MVP of Corks too. Corks too? Corks as well. <laughs> T O O. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, so Kim, is this more turn-based or? You pick up these cards and you make a deck. Okay. So this is like your opening deck. Okay, and but oh. You use them, you know, with the face buttons to do your attacks. Cool. Mm. But as you go on, like obviously you'll probably change your deck out, get better cards, all that fun stuff. For sure. Okay. Oh my god, I, I can't believe I spaced the name of it. What was the, uh, the Xbox game that they brought back? When the Xbox One was first coming out, and it was like a... Tacks were like decks of, 
it was like a card based thing, but it was not this kind of presentation. It was like a third person action game. I'm, I've been so vague that this is just filling the silence. Yeah. I would like to apologize, but, uh, but they brought it back, like on the Xbox One, very very early on in its lifespan. It was like a real puzzling decision because I was what the game I was like really into. Oh, okay. The original Xbox One. But... Yeah. Chat, let us know. I was gonna when you started. What the I was hell like, was Cork talking about? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That'd be a good series. Um, Somebody can read your mind. I was like. Because I thought for a second you were talking about like Killer Instinct. I was like, that's the only one no, I've seen. I'm but gonna I'm right. gonna search this up so you don't think I'm a <laughs> crazy here. person. Yeah. Yeah. Those unhinged rambling. <laughs> Sweet. It's like a uh, Phantom. Oh. Uh, what was that? Uh. <laughs> Phantom Dust. Phantom Dust. Yes. Oh. Yes. Okay. Um, you, did Thanks, you ever play Cap. that, Kim? Um, I've played it, but yeah. I feel like Am I meant to remember? Does this this seems to have like a like aesthetics aside, but a similar thing where you're getting cards and that's like your attack, and then you get better cards over time. Yeah, whatever. I believe so. Yeah, it's hmm. been a while. I don't like these these bunny guys popping my bubbles here. What about the house with the arms coming out though? Those mm. are good, right? Yeah, they were my my favorite in Final Fantasy. Yeah. Defeated by. A oh, it's a cuckoo clock. I'd like to apologize. Oh. Although technically, what? What? it is really it's going like... after the house aesthetic. Yeah. Right? It's like emulating it's a, it's that. It's the house. The house for the yeah. cuckoo. Yeah. <laughs> it's where the cuckoo lives. Yeah. So. I lost some shards. So your runtime was zero. Yeah, that can't anywhere. be right. Yeah, I was going to say, wait a minute. I re distinctly remember playing some of this. <laughs> so yeah, you increase like the tier of the cards as you go on. Cool. All right. So, so has you the... have the basics. Yeah. Do real good now. Okay. You got this. Yeah, baby. now you know. Yep. Yeah. So is this... Oh, and then, okay, the, the cards change on your different runs. Okay, cool. Yes. Yeah. Like that. Not bad cards the first time. Yeah, exactly. It was an unwinnable situation. Yeah. Yeah, that's, yeah, we'll just call it that. Yeah. <laughs> the developers I... are going to review this tape and they'll be like, you know what, we have to rebalance because we can't let people. All right, let, you're doing much Alex better. Do. See, look how good you are now. Yeah, this is yeah. much better. Yeah. I do like I the. I kind of like his, his slow. Gingerly run. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. If we had to rank our favorite runs, it would be right up there for today. I don't know, our friend in... a lot of interesting ones yeah. today. Our friend in, in Helheim, though, was, I think, <laughs> takes the cake. Yep. Absolutely. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, I'm liking these yeah. cards much better here. Yeah. That's a bold move in the demo. Yeah. Change it up <laughs> you just <bit>. random cards. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because literally someone could play it one time and be like, wow, that's the moveset? Yeah. I'm out. But no, yeah. these, are, these are much better here. It, yeah, it super sucks so hard. Or <laughs> it's good and fun. Yeah. That's really the two options in life. Mm -hmm. huh. Yeah. Let's see. You got this. What's this new card here? Cool. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. I like that. I like that. Need a key. Hopefully it's not like the basement key from the, the earlier game. <laughs> we'll still it's always described. wonder what that basement key was. Yeah. <laughs> what, what does the music sound like if you had to describe it? Oh, it's magical for it. I wish you could, yeah. I wish you could be, oh. be here with us. Yeah, does it have words? <laughs> it does, <laughs> no words. A oh. little poppy, very yeah. much. Yeah. I, uh, I need to hear it a little bit, a little bit better. I have yeah, you're pain painting a real picture for me. <laughs> <laughs> kind of, kind of poppy. Huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, yes. I got, I'll take it from here, Alex. <laughs> Perfect. It's my phantom dust. <laughs> that felt know. really good to hear yeah. someone say that out loud. <laughs> <laughs> know that you're in the right universe, at least for now. Yeah. Well, that's the worst feeling, and I managed to get myself in that situation yeah. at least four times a day. <laughs> Where I'm trying to describe something that no one knows what I'm talking about. Yeah. You're constantly wondering if you're in the midst of a Mandela effect moment. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Constantly. Yeah. Uh oh. 
Okay, our my clock tower friend, or clock tower. God, my uh, my cuckoo clock, clock friend is uh is back. Yeah, he's been doing push-ups too. Yeah. Oh yeah, like he's getting ready. Oh. Oh, he's pulling a cuphead enemy on you. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, do you think we'll see any Cuphead stuff tomorrow? Oh, yeah. We've been waiting on that DLC for yeah. a long time. Yeah. I forgot about that. And especially because they just announced the show was coming to Netflix. That's a good call, Cork. I didn't think about that. Thank you. Oh, let's see. Wouldn't it suck if the DLC is just clearly <laughs> chopped parts of the episode from Netflix? That, like They're like, uh, can we just borrow some of those? Full-on movie tie-in type thing. <laughs> oh, no. Please do the work for us. It's so much harder than we originally thought. <laughs> Jeff, you have, are uncanny at taking something I'm excited for potentially and then, <laughs> then dousing oh, it in reality. I don't reality. mean it like that. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff, Jeff for killer in dreams. No, no. no. I, hope, I hope the cartoon is fun and yeah. I hope that the DLC is fun too. Yeah. I like the Cuphead. That's yeah. Great. Okay. Oh, wait. No, you're dead. Okay. I thought I was about to die. Actually, Kim, this is this is solid. Yeah? Yeah. It controlled well for you? Yeah. Now that I have, like, cards that, that I like, I'm also close to death, but... Um... Can you walk in a tight circle? There we go. There you go. Not, not quite not to, as tight. Not to mention it again, but Ghost of the Sushi if you do that, you do, like, a weird jig. Yeah. <laughs> I do. Imagine. Yeah. I am I'm loving Ghost, and I'm probably gonna put that in as soon as I'm done here. Hey. <laughs> I like the idea of like building up your cards and continually getting better ones yeah. and change up your abilities. Can you get the same card that you already have and like a, a better version of it, or is it just constantly replacing things from that same school type? It looks like it's building it up. So like adding oh, yeah. different like damage effects or like oh. you know explosions. Okay, cool. So it's like you have a ranged attack with these modifiers. Yeah. You so, have an evade attack with or maneuver with these modifiers. Yeah. So okay. is this? This is called Dandy Ace. Dandy Ace. By the way. Yeah. Dandy um, Ace. Yeah. Um, I'm getting ready for when I die here in a second. But mm -hmm. is there like? I guess after every death, like. Mm -hmm. Does it just start you from zero, or like, is Ooh. it like more roguelike in that way, like, or did you not get that far, Kim? I didn't get that far. I'm actually really curious about progression and yeah. how everything works with the cards. Um, like, do you get to keep what you get to keep, what you don't? Mm -hmm. um... Yeah. So what came first? Do you think the design for that bad guy who has a page boy haircut, <laughs> or the title of the game Dandy? Ooh. Like, Dandy. You think Dandy came in, then they're like, like visually that that yeah. informs it, what the bad guy looks like. This yes. all needs to be Dandy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Get the top hat. What yeah. would Dandy look like? And there yeah. you go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They focus tested it that way. Oh, is his health? Yeah, buddy. Not oh, dying nice. on this one. Maybe. Woo! I'm also playing super safe, but that's okay. I want to try out. I like the, the my Y attack, the, the flash burst kind of that he does. Get that dash going, there we go. Cool. This is this is a good one to go out on, Kim. I like it. Oof. Yeah. <laughs> Pressure's off. You're good yeah. now. I was worried you were gonna hold it against me because you couldn't find that basement key for the rest <laughs> of <laughs> For the rest of my career at GI. Yeah. Kim, I have so much more I need to be worried about in my life. I, uh, <laughs> that that doesn't even chart. <laughs> if that's the low... Somebody wants to know what the challenge level is like in this game. How are you feeling about it? So far, it's... it's. I would say, obviously, just this is only being my second run. I've It's... Not in a bad way, but this is definitely a little bit easier run because I can, you know, I have a bit more ranged ability because I, I can dash a little bit more and, and whatnot. Um, so I'm wondering if it's going to come down to, oh, this is this is dubious here. I wonder if it's gonna yeah. come down to just the decks that you, you build, oh. you know? 
Let the RNG... Yeah, that first oh! one. Damn it. I wonder if the RNG Ooh. machine is gonna is gonna take hold here. Hmm. Okay. Oh. So well. in, I lose a I lose blueprints. So in I guess in that same way, kind of like a dead cells or a roguelite. Um, but like I I guess I'm like, what do the shards translate to? You know, I I have questions about yeah. About it's weird on. that it doesn't explain any of that. You just like get dropped in. Yeah. And are you know just trying to figure it out. So yeah. Yeah. And I wonder. Definitely. Yeah, I wonder... Okay, so it does start you off a little bit... Find the higher tier cards. ...different here, but I, I wonder if maybe in the main game you get a little bit more... Like, you know, a sense of what your, your those, like, shards are going to. Or I yeah, wonder no. maybe... No, <laughs> yeah, no, no, we skipped that. This actually has more than the main game's going to have. They're going to they're gonna be paring the systems down a lot. <laughs> I'm sorry, Alex. That's yeah. stupid. It's okay. <laughs> I I got a chuckle out of it, but I think I think that's a good place to 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 wrap this because I, I didn't get any different abilities than than the last time. So weird. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. So that's Dandy Ace. I think that was a good that was a good end cap. I think the last two games were were, were solid there. So that was fun. Jeff Cork. Yeah. Kim Wallace. Yes, sir. Thank you both for joining me. I hope you guys had fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Thanks for having me. Yeah, you're welcome. Chat, as always, I hope you guys had a good time. Uh, as we said at the beginning of the show, you can find all these titles on Xbox right now. Uh, they're all free demos that you can access on the front of the... I, I They they put a, a splash page on the front screen of the Xbox or the main menu of the Xbox. Um, and you can go and, and see what we played yesterday, um, what we played today. Uh, there was some really good, uh, I, I think I liked yesterday's crop of games a little bit better, um, but there were some good ones today. I think we ended on, on a strong note. So um, you can catch that on our YouTube page, youtube.com slash Game Informer. Uh, you can find um, all the content that we're doing on the website, gameinformer.com. These two uh, below me have, have been killing it lately, especially amongst all the upheaval and stuff. And you guys have really been rocks for, for GI, so I appreciate that about both of you. Um, oh, thank you. And, uh, and yeah, so thank you for joining us today. And then, uh, like we said earlier, we're going to be doing a lot of streaming tomorrow. The Xbox event is finally here. So if you came for Halo, we're sorry to disappoint you, but also it was in the, it was in the title. So, <laughs> so you know, that's not on us. But uh, Halo will be tomorrow, and I am so excited. I can't wait. Fingers crossed that it uh, is everything my little baby boy heart has dreamed about. So, But until then... Be good to each other, and we will uh, we'll see you next time.